When you receive your Convectex package, inspect the equipment for damage. Check all heating elements to make sure everything works and nothing was damaged from shipping. If the equipment was damaged from shipping, do not use. Contact us immediately at 877-375-0005. After prepping the room for heat, place the heater and the additional axial fans following this diagram to create the proper airflow. You will need to adjust the heater placement to maximize airflow according to the actual room configuration. Remember, the idea is that you will be turning the room into a convection oven through the use of high heat and air movement. Be sure to leave plenty of room in front and behind heaters and fans. If your treatment area has a 20 amp PTAC, then the best way to power the equipment is with the two-way AC power adapter splitter or the four-way AC power adapter splitter. The two-way adapter works with the Elite 4 bed bug heater and the four-way adapter works with the Elite 8 bed bug heater. To power the Elite 4 heater, unplug the PTAC and plug in the two-way power adapter splitter. The adapter provides you with two power cords. Plug those two power cords into two of the receptacles on the side of the heater. Next, find two 20 amp or 15 amp 120 volt circuits. Use these outlets to run power cords to the remaining two receptacles on the side of the heater. You now have full power going to your heater. If a PTAC outlet is not an option, then you'll need to find a total of four 20 amp or 15 amp 120 volt circuits and run power cords from those outlets to the four receptacles on the side of the heater. Be sure to order additional power cords for this type of setup. Note, each heating element draws 12 amps of power. When utilizing wall outlets, make sure the total power draw per circuit does not exceed breaker capacity. You should be using only one blue cord per 20 or a 15 amp 120 volt circuit.